Welcome, everyone, to another episode of Two Drunk Guys Watch. My name is Rory McLeod. I'm your host, and with me for this episode is Nate Patrick. Say hi, Nate. Ahoy. Ahoy, matey. Yes. And what are, and what are you drinking? I'm drinking Sailor Jerry. And what is Sailor Jerry? On the rocks. Uh, it's rum. It's a spiced rum. Uh, I'm a rum drinker when I'm not drinking beer. So, here. Interesting. So, I'm also drinking rum. So, for this episode... Um, the thing I'm going to start with is uh, Great Lakes Brewing Elliot Ness, mm. um, mm-hmm. which is pretty good in my Two Drunk Guys Watch beer, beer glass, yes. And then when that runs out, I have the Kraken. Ooh, um, I almost a, got that too. <laughs> <laughs> this is a Black Spice Rum. I started on it, I think, a couple episodes ago. I only drink it when we're recording, so I'm, I haven't put that much of a dent into it. But Yeah, I, had, I, I bought a bottle of the Kraken for my birthday last year. So yeah, you. I've learned at least for me, I have to mix it with water. It's very strong if you don't. Or um, Dr Pepper. I would recommend Dr Pepper. Oh, okay, okay, all right. Yeah, for any like for any really like black rum, Dr Pepper works, and like a clear rum, a uh, cherry Seven Up, something like that. Excellent. All right, try it out. Uh, this episode, uh, we have a film called Swing It Sailor, um, mm-hmm. which I picked purely based on the name. Mm-hmm. Um, and uh, it's uh, a comedy, allegedly, and we'll talk about that once the movie gets started. Before that, we'll be watching a short called No For Sure, which is about syphilis. So that should be exciting. Oh, boy. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> so sort of tied together uh, thematically. Sure. Um, and, uh, yeah, so I want to remind everybody to hit the like button if you enjoy this content. Yes, please. And, Yes, and also subscribe to the channel for notifications on future content. Okay, and uh, I guess we'll be full steam ahead here, and away we go. One hand behind my back. Yeah, I bet. I wonder what Betty Fredes is going to do with one hand behind your back. Isn't that like when you're fencing, don't you have to have one hand behind your back? Come with me. That is one of the rules, And I'll show you what every one of you can do (laughs) single-handed. Here. She's fencing something. You can tune in this wonderful new Westinghouse show. She's fencing stolen TVs. (laughs) just one hand like this, because it has the sensational new Westinghouse show. What's she going to do with her other hand, Nate? There's no more oh, it's behind her back. We can dials. we don't know yet. You just turn mm. this one dial. There's like a dude back there perfectly. waiting. Like, yeah. Now in the set that you're watching oh, now, does now. the channel ever come in like this and give you only sound? Well, I hope not. Or My internet's when the fucked if it does that. Clear like this. Is the sound ever so hard to get that all you hear is this? So the interesting thing about this is old timey TVs well, you had to tune, with this mm-hmm. right? New so you've heard the term "stay tuned," right? So oh, yeah, yeah. you had to literally like that tuned. dial she's fucking Picture with. You literally had to like, just like tweak that. it until you and got the signal. Tuned, this set yeah, like a radio. Yeah, because now, everything was over the air back really then. There was no cable. Cable didn't happen until like the sixties. In most table models. Yeah, now, so it was an over-the-air signal, and if your your TV street. got bumped or whatever, or there was they, wind or I don't know, whatever, difference, you it? had to sit there and mess Engineering with it. Engineering improvements mm-hmm. give you a huge 17-inch rectangular 17 screen inches, Nate. in this wonderfully compact new Westinghouse set. I'm just waiting for the syphilis part. And uh, I don't know what he's doing with this TV. It's a long and winding road to get to the syphilis. Yes, yes it is. Now, this set also has a built-in antenna. And that means that so in many the other areas, thing about this is no she's talking about the fact that the TV has an antenna in it. So it used to be, so and you've seen you know, houses that had really antennas on them, right? I am old enough, yes. Small screen. You had when to you wire your TV to the antenna, house like literally at a modest price. run a wire Just ask your dealer from your attic the into the friggin' TV. Yeah, and there was there were screws on the back you had to tighten it down with. Yeah, yeah. You can be sure. And unless you were good with that kind of crap, you'd have to hire somebody. (laughs) Anyway, there's a a look into our past. Speaking of that, no for sure. Now, Nate, you'd better know for sure. No comment. Next time you go down to the docks in Manila, Mm -hmm. looking for a good time. Or last time. Yes, a last time, yeah. Tony Montana and that uh, looks like uh, Strad Vanzerovich. Yeah. On the right. Tony Montana and say hello to my little friend. I think that's what he's painting here. Oh. Wait, very long. S U S U V. No. Son. I think you spelled son wrong. Yeah, like a child. 
Plus, the ampersand is way off. One of them is way off center. Because <laughs> look at <laughs> it. It's hard to tell because you can't see his whole name, but it looks like it's. They're both off center. Hey! hey! You stupid immigrant. Get out of here. It cost for a drink. <laughs> that wasn't his shop. He was like vandalizing someone <laughs> else's shop. <laughs> this is 1930s vandalism. Yes. I got everything already, Now, I think this was from the 40s. I think this is actually after our feature film, but not by much. Uh -huh. Syphilis was a thing that was more into the mainstream after World War II, at least in the U.S. And, of course, it existed before that, but it wasn't like a thing people talked about. Although, um, if you've seen the movie Sex Madness... I'll uh, look it up. Yeah, it's like Reefer Madness, but it's about syphilis, I think. Okay. okay. Purely about syphilis? Is it, yeah, is, I think is so. A syphilis PSA? Yeah, basically, it's like a cautionary, okay. you know, if you're around loose women, your dick's going to fall off. Oh. Oh. Oh, we've got an accordion solo. I need to start drinking. It's a two-headed mutant, sir. She's alright. It's fine. It's cool. She's, it's cool. It's cool, baby. What happened to your face? What's the matter of your face? Hey! I got syphilis on my face. <laughs> on his face. You could. <gasps> my accordion. Uh huh. Can you speak well, up, sir? I can't hear you. What's the matter, you? What <laughs> questions? Don't tell me well, no more lies. No, please, and now you've got to be crazy. What's the happen? It drives me crazy. <laughs> Did anyone ever tell you, Tony, that you've got... But you're ugly as a... What are you talking about? I never got any success for it. I want you to think back carefully. Now, Tony, I want you to think. I know it's difficult. Do you remember ever having a sore that didn't... On your dick. No, 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 I never... <laughs> a sore on your ball sack. Yes, about a, two years ago. I'd say before I was married, I got a little uh -huh. sore, but... Yeah. But I buy her some salve, I put them on, and she gets all cured. I burned myself on the pasta no, man, <laughs> I burned myself on a master jelly. Yeah. I've got syphilis. I'm almost sure syphilis killed your baby, Tony. You see? Syphilis hates syphilis babies. Syphilis will go away without any treatment in time, but the germs stay in your body. You mean I yes, hate. Tony. I'm afraid that you I am a Maria germ. She gave it to you're the full of germs, Tony. Also, you're an immigrant. Oh, here it goes. It's corkscrew time. Tony! I just want to cut up some onions. I don't want to live anymore. So this guy, this actor playing the Italian guy, not Italian, by the way. At least his name isn't Italian. I looked it up, so he's just like some generic white bread name. Um, so fun fact I looked up about syphilis. Syphilis has a number of nicknames, amongst them the Great Imitator. Uh, because it's apparently the symptoms look like other diseases. Okay. The pox, right? But, sure. Sure. Uh, and bad blood. Oh, really? Like the ministry song? Yes. Um, which, the if you've heard of the Tuskegee syphilis experiment. Yes, I have, actually. That is what they were intentionally uh, infecting the patients with. Mm. Al Jurgensen. Yes. Yeah. Al Capone. Speaking of that, I also happen to have a list of people who famously had syphilis. Okay. Which is very exciting. So we'll go through it because this is kind of dragging. Yeah. Al Jorgensen. Yes. Some guy named John Batman, which I think is pretty exciting. I don't know who he is, but nice. I like it. Don't be too long. Okay. Napoleon Bonaparte. Uh, sure. You've heard of him. Uh, Al yep. Capone, which you just mentioned. Uh huh. Uh, Henry Stewart, second wife of Mary Queen of Scots, had the, the drip or whatever. Uh, Good for her. Let's see, Gauguin, who was a painter. Henry VIII, we've heard of him. Oh yeah, he had a 
He had a life. Yeah. Uh, I, Ivan the Terrible. Okay. Scott Joplin, who was a composer. Janis Joplin? Janis Joplin's uh, brother, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Let's see. John Keats, who was a poet. Uh, Frederick Nietzsche. Right. That makes sense. Uh, Leo Tolstoy, who was a novelist. Uh-huh. Uh, Van Gogh. Uh, well, yeah. Oscar Wilde, which shouldn't really That's surprise right, anybody. Right. Not really, no. You and your wife must come Franz here Schubert. You mustn't miss a single treatment. Who was another musician that. guy. He was a composer. Classical life. guy? Churchill's dad, Thank apparently. You, oh, okay. <laughs> and Harry Nelson Pillsbury, who I assume is the Pillsbury Doughboy. Goodbye, Tony. Is now. He is now. Yeah, and Adolf Hitler. Oh, oh well. So, he deserved it. Quite the list. Oh, Dr. Perkin. Yes? Stein! I want to thank you for taking an interest in Tony Madroni and his wife. All Tony Madroni. Oh, that's the... Okay. Morton, I was the intern on the Madroni case. Oh, yes, Dr. Morton. I'm very glad... It was also known as the French disease. Oh, Okay. Because apparently it was well, first probably not right. contracted, but called a, dis a, a distinct well, disease back well, in the um, Napoleon the era. Well, so there we go. Later, I, Got it. Now mind. that we're all caught up. Now that we're all caught up. Very important information. Yes. Uh, PSA. Don't well, get I syphilis. Kind of worried about it. Yeah. I happen to. Yeah, I got my syphilis right here. Yeah, that's right. I brought, I brought it with me. <laughs> I got scared. I got scared. I peed myself. Hmm. Did the photo got syphilis on tap. Right? Yes, sir. Yeah, he's got a tap in the back with syphilis you know, in it. He's <laughs> like, yeah. Just like mine did. If you Take two of the these. Or, uh, yeah. Call me in the morning. The might still be yeah. in your body. I found out all the things that could happen to you if you didn't There's the syphilis right gang on the poster behind him. better come down here and... I know about it. It's like a feature film movie poster. The syphilitic gang. The <laughs> <laughs> yes, doctor. Nurse, this man has syphilis. Prepare the preparation. All right, take off your coat and roll up your sleeve, please. Take off your clothes. Now this blood test will show... My sleeve? Do I have it on my arm? A ah, cold my precious sleeve. Syphilis. What is this? Heroin. Now, if this makes you nervous... <laughs> I'm just going to shoot him up with heroin. <laughs> your head. Make a tight You're not going to care. It's going to hurt much, Doc. Yeah, or... yeah, you won't care about the syphilis anymore. You'll be high as a kite. As soon as we finish this, you can go into the other room and Dr. Howard will give you a complete physical examination. And more syphilis. Me no like you, these. People getting injected with shit. Yeah. Enjoy, everyone. Like <laughs> yeah, right? Sit down. Make yourself comfortable. Thank you. Sit down before you fall down. Make yourself very comfortable. Men and women in this country. In fact, I've got a lace teddy I'd like you to wear. A pretty sad state of affairs when we have to depend on luck. I guess I'll close the door, jerks. If they could see the truth behind newspaper articles reporting nervous. Let me find my stash here. Here we go. Jugs magazine. They'd find a shocking percentage could be chalked up to late stocks. Nope. Now I was called as a as a consultant in this case. Thrust magazine. Stanton, they make great uh, turntables. Yeah. Probably contracted syphilis 15 or 20 years ago. Yeah. The outward symptoms disappeared and he thought he was cured. Beautiful. Does your turntable have syphilis? Judgment went bad, <laughs> by the time he went Did you notice any sores on your turntable? He could save his money or Stanton. And yet he could have been cured if he'd received medical care in time. Surely. Have you listened to Lana Del Rey recently? Test and proper treatment mm. years ago. What, does she have syphilis? I don't know. I... Now here's another problem. Let's assume she does. Well, I'm saying a Lana Del Rey album might give your turntable syphilis. Ah. By the transit of property. Ah, yes. Yeah. This is very highly uh, scientific research that I've done. Yes. Or listening to No Doubt. Two months ago, he had a heart attack while he was driving his car. More true. Mm. My God. There's a whole pamphlet about a guy who had a heart attack driving his car. Syphilis killed them all. Yes, but Good riddance. Know as much about syphilis as young fellows do today. <laughs> well, Morton, I'd like to agree with you, but I can't. Oh. Now, here's a typical case. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Jump cut. Yep. Yep. Here's a typical case. What an Gary asshole. College athlete. Do I look like the Pope? Son of respectable family. 
Jerry's story began the afternoon of the last football game of the season. Or he, he threw and the game. Teammates had won the game and decided to go out for a little celebration that evening. Hmm. And get it wet yeah, down at the local, you know, know house of ill night. repute. A harbor. Sure. Ladies mm -hmm. in the parlor. Ladies in the parlor. <laughs> I love her little tiara that she's got on. <laughs> You've all got syphilis. Yep, you too. Yep, mm -hmm. you got the drip. That's right. She's all up in that oh. French disease. That's right. Jerry had his celebration. That's a cake job if you if he can Don't get it. Just answering the door like, yep, come in. You there you go. Where you are. Yeah, she doesn't have to service any of these dopes. She's just door lady. In. Yeah. Yeah. What's your and name? you get a tiara. Jerry Anderson. But she probably has to smell, yeah. you know. Bleh. Well, I mean, there's ups and downsides to every job. To go to a private. You should burn some incense or something. I don't know what to do. Call the county health department see if they couldn't do something. They just laughed at me and hung up. Come and see you. Hmm. What's your trouble, Jerry? Well, I'm stupid. I've got a pretty bad sore down here. Oh, shit. On his thumb? Just stretch out on the table over there. We'll <laughs> That'll fix it. <laughs> Why don't you lay down for a while? That'll, it'll go away. Yeah. Come over here. I can, I I can see almost see your dick in this thing. Let's go. Hold on. Uh, hold on. Uh, this, uh, there Up. we go. Uh, I gotta change lenses. What the hell am I looking at here, Doc? This dark field test shows sea up monkeys. the fire teeth. Can you uh, see them wriggling back and forth across <laughs> the slime? I think yes. they're sea monkeys. What did you call them? Shrinking Pyro eggs. Keeps. What'd you call me? Those are the germs that cause your syphilis. You had to learn the hard way. I thought it was caused by, by the, the devil. Woman whether she has syphilis or not. Yeah, make sure you ask her up front. Hey, <laughs> do you have syphilis? <laughs> I guess that finishes me. Hey, I'm pay paying 50 bucks for this. You, got, you gotta tell me if you have syphilis or not. Cool it's only fair. 50 bucks? It's like a thousand dollars back then. Well, problem by running five away bucks. I don't know. You may not realize it, but you're a very lucky young man because we're catching this in time to cure you. You're very lucky. You've got it's super gone. syphilis. Uh, four-tenths Neo injection. Yes, but doctor, I can't take a chance. Inject him in both cheeks. Is school finding out I've got syphilis? Now, don't worry about having syphilis. Don't worry. Luckily, we'll we'll print it in the newspaper. You don't have to tell anybody. Will disappear, and you won't be able to infect anybody. Yeah, because you'll be dead. Well, Dr. Dr. Perkins later went on to open, open a restaurant chain. Here, please, and roll up your yes, shoes. and also a mutual of Nobody Omaha. Ever know <laughs> Wild Kingdom. But you have to report every week and not place a single treatment for it. Yeah, you're going to have to shoot year. up every week. That's your relief. Just like Trent Reznor. Like living again. Yeah, more of this. No thanks. Turns out he's got radioactive blood. I always heard that shots for syphilis were painful. Not if you go to a doctor who knows right. his business. I don't know. Possibly. I'm just, just thinking about how, like, this is, this might be how things. ministry albums are made right here. Oh, yeah. Like in this office? Gee, doctor, I... Sure. There's like a back room with a recording studio, and they're just... It's, you know, it's, it's a visual uh, representation. Oh, oh, okay. You know. Not literally. Yeah, dramatic reenactment. Oh, oh, okay, okay. We're not going to do anything harmful to the girl. I'm sorry, I don't know why I've got such a bad blood for a ministry right now. But... <laughs> If we can treat and cure you... And if we can treat you, we can treat anyone. We're breaking another link in the evil chain of syphilis. That the evil chain of disease. syphilis. That sounds like a magic item. <laughs> We've found that one Plus three. of syphilis usually <laughs> results in three more. Each of the three results This one is in you, another. Jerry. So you can see, Jerry, that every time we treat... This is the whore you were with last night. We're preventing the spread of syphilis to many hundreds of... How come that one's kind of colored in, but not really? It's like half syphilis? So you're doing your job by coming to me... Only traces. Season, and I'll do mine... Oh, oh, okay. Jerry, at any time, have you been a sailor? I'm beginning to see <laughs> what we're up against. The Hello, sailor. sailor. Over again. What are we going to do to put young... Well, I have plenty of that in the, in the movie. I'll show you one of the answers to that question. Speaking of... Have time to spare? Mm -hmm. I'm right doctor. I'm about halfway sure through now. my Elliot Ness already. Doing here? Yeah, I've well, finished my sandwich. I... I'll be right back. <laughs> I gotta bring it with me. I, I'll, I'll just have it here. Because there's plenty of ice. I got a lot of ice. Yeah. Yeah, make sure to stock up. Yeah. yeah. All right, I'll, I'll be right back. Those are the facts about syphilis and its dangers. But why let syphilis get started? You can't have syphilis or gonorrhea 
unless you expose yourself to the germ. I exposed myself smart, earlier. You keep Is that away okay? From prostitutes and pickups. <laughs> Most of them have syphilis or gonorrhea. I would like to. Safe, and they can't be made. Safe. Actually, you know what? I can wait. As you leave I'll wait till the credits. At this the is door. Marvel's latest Ask movie, Syphilis Man. Oh, God, don't get me started. <laughs> they will answer almost any question that comes to your mind. No, not that one. God. You'll find that those folders give simple, straightforward facts with no punches pulled. Yeah, but they're empty folders. What do they mean by sucker? <laughs> <laughs> well, oh, boy. Anybody what do you think that prostitute was doing last night? I don't know. Uh, uh, and there are hundreds of thousands of them in this country. Millions of them. Billions. Well, maybe not billions. Of millions every year. Just the other day, I heard of a tragic case. Doctor Paxton. Bill Paxton. <laughs> this guy's got uh, the double cane action going. He's got he's got a secret hooks reserve in each cane. That's the life. But this is the Ministry of Silly Walks. Well, Mr. Spencer, I can see you. I'm huge. Better since that last Look at this guy. <laughs> Sit down. Sit What's with this down. angle? He's like humongous. No, no that that mustache is very bad. unnecessary. My legs seem yes. to be getting Egregious. worse every day. But yours is a very stubborn case, Mr. Spencer. You're very, very stubborn. Stubborn indeed. Stupid canes. But you must remember that every rocky road in you life. You must has remember planet. this. A kiss is just a kiss. I have just perfected a new remedy <laughs> for a locomotive attack. A sigh is just a sigh. It's taken me years of research. But, Doctor, you've been prescribing it's new goat medicine semen. for me for a long time. Mm -hmm. I've paid you over $2,000. You did? Yeah, but Mr. your check Spencer, didn't clear. I'd sooner cut off my right arm up to there than take another dollar from you if you've lost faith in my ability. Or my That's more like a shoulder. I'd rather cut yeah. off my right shoulder. The arm just kind of... Goes with it. I didn't mean yeah, to keep the keep the arm, but cut off the shoulder. I don't mind putting out the money. <laughs> yeah. Just surgically remove your shoulder, and then you the can like staple the arm to your chest. You feel any better? Is it now? Well, is it now? Maybe since you put so much time on the new medicine, I yeah, yeah, ought that's to give it. it a fair uh -huh. trial. Are you really sure it will help me? Why, of course I'm hey, It's sure. goat's milk. I don't know. This medicine, yeah, I milk. Ask you this again, quote, quote unquote. Paxton's panacea. I mean, we milked a goat. Three bottles wink, wink. Of this scientific discovery of mine at five dollars a bottle. Oh, and that's it. Five bucks. The last evil germ of syphilis from your body. Sure. I just follow the directions. Each bottle. Will now I have a question. Why aren't normal doctors prescribing and on this? The ninth day, oh. All your pains will have vanished. Was it say all of Pasadena? Pasadena. <laughs> yeah. Take some Pasadena and call me in the morning. What's he doing? Writing his last will and testament here. Filling out My the. My uh, darling Martha. Is that to park for the Rose Bowl? Oh, oh dear! I, oh wow! <laughs> wow, that uh, <laughs> that took a turn. I guess the uh, medicine didn't work. Morton is no excuse for that. We've got the weapons to wipe out this disease. To use them, doctors must have the help of everyone who has been exposed to syphilis. Merp, merp, come on! And Put more it. funding syphilis from the government. Killed yes. baby. He's driving like ten miles an hour. Back with blind and insanity. How many times is he going to erase that? With modern methods. Just three more times, and then we'll be good. No quack doctor or medicine you quack, buy quack. can do the job. Quack quack. Don't be a sucker. Bill Paxton, Six specialist in men's diseases. <laughs> Prostitutes and pickups. Land sakes. And cannot be made safe. You boys all have the syphilis. Doesn't pay to take a chance. Her job is to nod Watch and then the warning, not say anything about the syphilis. That's like the easiest job. I know. Go to a Where do I sign up? Like she's basically a doorman. Yeah. At once. A concierge. Oh, do we have to see this time. again? Oh. Uh, really? Get a blood test. <laughs> Come on. Examination <laughs> now. We get it. No. By the oh, way, um, sure. there is another version of this film that has like shots of people with syphilis like the the sores and stuff oh thankfully that's isn't this version <laughs> like the like the health class film that you had yeah to, yeah and things falling off and stuff yeah what is this hold on how did we get here <laughs> i'm lost i need an adult help help <gasps> Oh. As much as I want to see this, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna. I'm gonna get some, my Sailor Jerry and bring it here so it's at the ready. 
thinking it's grown up at all. C-3PO has syphilis. Very dangerous. Yes, C-3PO has syphilis. Into your lungs, and it's very bad for your heart. Yeah, but we're droids. We don't, I know, we I don't care about that. Humans do, and I think we should set a good example. Well, humans are stupid, R2. Well done, R2. Oh, hello. Oh, the fourth wall. You know, oh. Smoking is bad for your health, and it isn't grown up at all. So no. please, don't smoke. Give a hoot, don't pollute. R2. Really oh, that was very off center. Yes, that's okay. Come along, R2. Are they on the Death Star? You can't possibly get in. So that's what they were doing. When they were trapped in that room. Yeah, Han, Han and Luke are trying to rescue Leia. This is what they were doing. <laughs> Hold on, we gotta film a. <laughs> we gotta film a PSA. Yes. Stormtroopers are banging on the door. Yeah. Fully like, Hold on. And alas, so they snuck in a, a, a camera crew. All right, R2. I'll ask them. Parents of Earth, are your well, Han was an accomplished smuggler, so. Diseases? That's true. Call doctor, local health department, and find uh -oh. out. Immunize uh, your children, uh, please. And may the force be with you. May the farce be with you. Please don't let your children get uh, syphilis. Yeah, is there? I don't think there's an immunization against syphilis, though. There should be. Yeah, you think they would have figured that out by now? You think? All right, this is our feature film, Swing It Sailor. Oh boy, Grand National. Grand National. Don't they make hot dogs? Don't they make hot dogs? Uh, maybe? I thought a Grand... Isn't, isn't there a Grand National... Isn't there a car? Um, Grand National? Like a, like a Buick? Buick Grand National? Is that a car? There's a Grand Wagoneer. I don't think that's a Jeep, though. Cully Richards. And David Diamond! Two people toiled over this screenplay. Yeah. Gaston! Look at this technical advisor, Lieutenant Commander GWD Dashel, US, U.S. Navy retired, I think is what that says. Uh, sure. Dun, 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 dun. Now, what does the GWD stand for, I wonder? I don't know. Gone with the wind. Gone with the... No, can't be gone <laughs> with the wind. All right, here's the parade of ships. The first of many stock footage sequences. All right, so this is as good a time as any to talk about this thing. This is a 1938 American film directed by actor, screenwriter, Raymond Cannon, who is not in the movie, but he's the director. But this movie is canon. There are cannons in it. Oh, even better. Yes. So these dopes are obviously on a Navy ship. And they're about to get into, into some shenanigans. Oh. This is known as Reveille. I don't know if you know that has a name. That yeah. little, yeah. And I checked because I thought it was odd they were doing that on a Navy ship, but apparently they did that. So. Yeah, I think that's uh, through all the military branches they do that. Well, they don't do it anymore. Well, but okay. They, they, they used to. Certainly yeah. during this time they did. So. Just to remind everybody, 1938 is pre-World War II, just prior to World War II. Yeah, yeah. And, of course, we wouldn't be involved for three more years, but... No. Ah, God damn it. Some of these guys probably got out of the service before. Just in time. I doubt any of these people were in the service. Maybe they were. I don't know. Well, no, I'm saying, I'm saying at, the t at the time, World War yeah. II didn't start. If they're older, if, you know, if they put enough time, they got out just in time. Well, they had a draft in World War II, so it's very likely these actors probably would have been drafted, some of them. Come on, no, not the actors, they're like up. characters. We're home. Oh, 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 yeah. Pete, this is one day you don't want to end up in the brig. Uh, that's right. I like it in Come the brig. On. You're one day from retirement, Pete. <laughs> <laughs> oh, young love. Poor Husky sure got it bad again. Poor Peach, I mean. Yeah, he should go gay like Husky we did. He gets married and leaves the Navy. He won't last that long without Husky around to do his dirty work. 
Husky. Wake up. Come on. Husky Get was up. a brand of jeans, wow. I believe, right. in the 70s. And a size you in the 80s and 90s. <laughs> yes. Hey. I don't know. Why you looking for trouble, you baby? little asshole. It's looking for you while I'm wearing this. All right, last What, a shirt? Come on, shake the leg. Yeah. Oh, it is good. it's a good thing, yeah. Thanks, Husky, old pal. I nearly lost my temper that time. Now, if you had uh -huh. him, I'd busted him in the nose. Yeah, probably not a good idea to bust your superior officer in the nose. Nope. Now he's got to put on his push-up bra. Hey, Pete. <laughs> what? Yeah? Oh, this is in the trailer. Thing. All right, Angel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is the ex this is the exciting action in the hey, trailer, yes. Yeah. <laughs> nah, he's just a little baby. They're on the wrong oh. side, you idiot. So Boys, I think I hope you've all had Husky a nice time can't on swim, this which is why what those because are for. I think they inflate. The lovers are gonna get down to work. Oh, the like floaties. Look like something yeah. For this inspection. Yeah. And if any of you are expecting But why is he walking around the deck? I guess if he fell overboard, he'd have to. Okay. The bright work yeah, on the bridge. Yeah, precaution. Sure. Some paint for you two. I guess. First turret. What kind of Second noob turn. joins the Navy and they can't the swim, swamp, though? You. It's, well, I mean, well, I, I almost joined the Navy and they asked me if I could swim, and I said what no. Nice, easy job that's why, uh, that's what I thought all the boats were for, and I didn't get the job. They said hit the bricks, Nate. Yeah. There it is. I've got it. You're going to go up there and paint the spot on the top of that pretty little smokestack. You're going to climb that shit like Spider-Man. That comes straight from the heart, shipmate. Mm. Now turn two, all of you. By the way, I love you. Come on. I'm naming my next cat Shipmate. <laughs> yeah, just for one of my busy. For the record, my my too. current cat's yeah, name is Shitrock. Dirty trick. Oh, ah. That's all right. I'm getting used to that guy giving me the works. Give me the yeah. works like a pizza? I might fall down and get killed. Oh, yeah. Then I'll have peace. Pete. You're no peace in our time. Orders is orders. There's we will not find the peace. reason why there's That's what right. to do. The die. next ten years will be very the peaceful. Noble 600. Mm. Especially if he falls and breaks his neck. Goodbye, pal. Hey, yeah, Pete, then he won't let me have go up there to do anything. Oh, no, I couldn't let right. you do that, Husky. They won't know the difference. I wouldn't think of it, but I got to That's go what we call a blessing in disguise. Let me go, please. Yeah, so Husky well, is this guy on the left here. Oh, oh gosh, I never think Okay, so the guy on the right. Wouldn't you? Honest? Sailor Jerry. Ah, but yes. to worry from about now on. The line, is it? Jerry. So I think the character's actual name is Pete, but that's boring, so we'll call him Sailor Jerry. Yeah. Pull, Jerry, pull! And the rest hey, of the Pete, movie is let this. Let me off the fifth floor. Press the button and little Pete will do the rest. <laughs> All right, so okay. how is how is Jerry pulling? Uh, I mean, I understand like pull these systems to an extent. How is he yeah. pulling uh, his buddy there, uh, <laughs> who is heavier than him, plus all that rope, which adds to the thing, and what's that the uh, what's the, the, the buckle there? Not buckle, but you know the buckle. Know. Yeah, the R buckle. R buckle, yeah, fatty R buckle. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah. I'm not really sure what you're asking, Nate, but sure. Like, how is he doing this? He's just pulling. What, what's the... Right, but, like, the weight distribution of his his friend who is... Oh, I see, because he's not heavy enough to... Yeah, that makes sense. I don't know how he's doing that. Yeah. And this is just me. Theoretically, you would think that Sailor Jerry should go up and... Well, he should, except he's afraid of heights. Which they mentioned while we were yapping. Yeah, but Perfect. I don't, know. I, I don't understand physics. No, clearly. Or math or numbers. Clearly, you is... don't have a doctorate in physics. <laughs> no. Pete no. wants to be an aviator. <laughs> <laughs> so he's pretending to be Pete. The the husky guy went up there in his place. Right. And here comes Captain Crunch. And his gang of officers. There's a wet spot there. He slips and falls. Ah. Blood. I knew it. He's someone has syphilis. Some <laughs> All right. Yay. Oh. Yay. 
Where is that bosun's mate? Well, the, the bosun's over there. I don't know where his mate is. Probably in a cage. Attention. The mate's in the infirmary with syphilis. <laughs> you in charge of these men? Yes, sir. That man that's doing all the painting? Yes, sir. I've got chocolate Have sauce all over my me. face. Aye, aye, sir. Not now. There's plenty of time. Let him finish his work. <laughs> Not now. Aye, Wait five minutes, then go. Yeah. It's kind of a poor attempt at blackface there. Yeah. What a day. Boy, I hope nobody saw that. Just inside this here. I would imagine it's kind of hard to sneak around on a Navy ship. Yeah. Although Steven Seagal did it in Under Siege. <laughs> yeah. The entire the entire movie. Which is basically a remake of this. <laughs> but less funny. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Or arguably more funny so far. Uh, certainly parts of it are more funny. I think Tommy Lee Jones did a good job in that movie. Yeah. Thanks, Phil. As the crazy bad guy. Whee! Before and Erica Oleniak uh, had a memorable part in that movie. Yep. Yes, she did. With the birthday cake, yeah. Mm -hmm. Well worth uh, watching the well, watching at least up to that point. Yeah, All thirteen year old well, remembers so that myself, movie well. Mm. Yes, sir. A fine paint job. You might even. It'd be awesome if one of these guys recreated that scene in this movie. <laughs> yeah. Or maybe it's because you hit him in the face with a bucket of paint. Report to him. Oh yeah. Oh hey, you you want to oh, switch places again? Oh, that was an awful screw <laughs> you made out of the captain. Well, I didn't do shit. Oh, you're liable to get years. Yeah, in the bite me. That. Oh, don't think oh, it's no. so hard. You've been in the oh, brig. Oh no. Before. What, what am I gonna do? Uh, Golly gee, Willikers. Lose sight of him. Why not? Well, you think I won't let him go ashore alone? Why well, he'd marry that girl and my back's turned. He'd get all mm, kinds of syphilis. Some fast thinking, then, sailor. <laughs> Beat me to it. <laughs> All right, I've polished off my Elliot Ness. Ah. Uh, it's now time, very soon, to release oh, the Kraken. Yeah. Not yet, though. Soon. Congratulations. I'll make a formal announcement. I'm the way you okay. the stack. You're yeah, done we're all waiting for it. <laughs> yes. to see it. Honestly? Yeah. And it may mean a I'm sure most viewers tune in to oh, find out when I'm drinking what I'm during the episode. <laughs> That's the only reason you I watch. No, yeah. sir. You did it, and you're going to get the credit. Oh, yeah. That's just like you. Gee, thanks. Oh, it's nothing. Sailor Jerry. I want to see you to get everything that's coming to you. What could oh. I do for extra credit, sir? <laughs> well, bend over and I'll show you. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder if these guys know Popeye. Um, it might be in their like uh, LinkedIn. Oh, friend, maybe in their network. Friends list. Yeah, network. Their network. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Um, those Monday. of you who have not seen, we have a movie called Tuesday. The Dragon Lives Again. Wednesday. In which Popeye is an actual character. Thursday. And Friday. it's pretty nuts. So Today's if you Friday. ever have a chance, go what back a couple episodes ago. I think it's episode eight or nine, I think. I'm and uh, check that out. Husky is safe in the brig. <laughs> That's one place no woman can get to him. Hey, what's the idea of always breaking up his romance? I know. But finish the watching this episode first. Yes, way. absolutely. <laughs> yes. But, but then you should go back and watch up. The Dragon Lives Again, because it's amazing. Link in description. Strategy? I don't know. Who is it this time? Uh, I'm delegating your channel now. I, I, I think our viewers can figure out how to can navigate. Quick. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. He's not so dumb after Unless they're too <laughs> drunk. Hey, what do you so mean? he's doing I like a tarot reading? What's, what's he doing here? You know, we've been studying aviation for a long time. Oh, that was witchcraft back then. Get thrown overboard for that shit. You think she can't leave the Navy now. Hey, Pete! Husky wants to see him in Maybe it's like his collection That's of baseball like cards. I think they had those back in the 30s, right? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. lovesick. All right, I'm now starting on the Kraken. Uh, Whoa. Release the Kraken. Husky. He's already dug a hole in the wall like in uh, Shawshank Redemption. Mm-hmm. Covered it with a oh, uh, poster of... Who was the poster yeah, of? Sorry, I got you into this. Oh, it was I guess some, you couldn't help it. Was some uh, blonde bombshell, right? It was like... Uh, yeah. yeah. No, thanks. Oh, yeah. It was uh, uh, Merv Griffin. You can do me a favor. Yep. 
Yep. <laughs> Anything you say, Husky. You know it is now. Willing to cut my right it is now. For you. From what now until now? the end of time. Would you, <laughs> We've. Would you sorry for ruining, ruining your Shawshank. What for? Well, I'm writing my girl a letter, and I gotta tell her that I won't be able to see her today. Why? I'll we'll never watch Shawshank the same again. Yeah, I went blind. Oh, is it Raquel? Oh, is it Raquel? Oh, Raquel? Is it? No. I no. Think you better send her a telegram. Just oh, Rita Hayworth. Rita Hayworth. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just soon as I get out of Raquel here. Welsh uh, recently oh, died. Just I believe. Leave it to uh, like the oh, other day. Yeah. Something. Yeah, days ago. Yeah. Now you're bringing everybody down, Nate. I'm sorry. I'm. That was not. Tell her I love her. She, oh, she was amazing. Um, I, oh, I, I, I tried to get a couple of her earlier movies, her. like oh, A Million Years B.C. and stuff, but they are not oh, available. All? No. How much you need? But those are good flicks. Oh, five or ten bucks? Well, here. Here's Same. five bucks. Buy some syphilis. Please don't yep. forget Go about Go knock yourself out. Telegram. Literally. My whole future may depend on it. Sure, My I whole know. future. What's the address? One, two, three, ask the address. What a fucking shit. No, he's going ashore to see the girl. Oh. We, we've stepped all over the plot. So basically... Yeah, I should pay, t I should pay more attention. Well, I'll just tell you. So that husky guy is going to propose marriage to this lady here. Okay. And Sailor Jerry doesn't want him to. He wants him to stay in the Navy. Uh -huh. So that's the plot of the whole movie so far. All right. Then the left. Now bend Just shaking it, yeah. Or to use the vernacular. <laughs> Shake what one. your mama gave you. One, two, one, two. One, two, buckle my now shoe. Now raise the right leg and kick. Three, four, shut the front door. Well, uh, you get a you get a workout whenever you can, my really. Anchor. Yeah, back in the thirties, yeah. Mm -hmm. well, they didn't exactly have Planet Fitness back then. Here's all my junk. Here it is. Just open the oh. junk drawer. <laughs> the junk hey, drawer. Myrtle, how do you get all those fellas? Myrtle the turtle. It's a gift, I guess. Just a gift. But yeah. ain't you scared Could be that rack. I don't know. Why? Maybe. Uh, who cares? But that fellow that's coming off the ship Or in today. lieu of payment. I don't know. You. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I owe you. Well, I wish I had your technique. Uh-huh. <laughs> Her technique? Where mm -hmm. is that phone? The, uh... Well, I don't want to be indelicate, but... Hello? And the the letters B, and then oh. J. It's Oscar Hinkelmeyer. Oh. Dr. Mm. Hinkelmeyer Schmidt. His name is my Mr. name, too. Woo! Mr. Hinkelmeyer. Sounds like a German. Hello, Oscar, you little sweetie. Hi, how are you? You have syphilis. You have syphilis. Oh, I can't <laughs> it's the health board. Oh, They're calling everybody individually who's got syphilis. <laughs> no, I can't Tuesday. I think I'm going to have another headache. I thought she's scheduled to have a headache on Tuesday. Yeah. Let me pencil it in for 3 o'clock. I wish I could plan out my headaches. That'd be real useful. Right? You just, like, schedule them, like, 100 years in advance. It's like, I'm not doing anything next Wednesday. I guess I'll have a headache then. No, you schedule them so far apart. Ooh, brutal. Ding dong. Well, that must be the rear admiral. Tell him I'll be right <laughs> on. Rear admiral. Yeah, I bet. He likes it from the rear. Yeah, I don't think he's an admiral in those swabby Listen, clothes. Listen, I'm a man of a few words, and I believe uh, you're getting to the you're point. You're not. The... Don't you think you're a little too young to get married? You're not funny. A uh, beautiful girl like you can have you pick and choose the men. So why waste your time on an ordinary sailor who, after he gets out of the Navy, won't even have a $30 a month job? Oh, sailor Jerry. Besides, the Navy needs men like Husky. Mm -hmm. Big, strong, dumb fellas to protect little girls like you. Big but dummies. Who is this guy? Hey, what is this? What are you trying to pull? That's, That's me. <laughs> I mean, she's who you think I am, I guess. Mm -hmm. What are you born? I yeah, the first one didn't match the tender photo. Well, maybe mm -hmm. I do. No. What Blimey's tail. Now I mean, he's desperate. He don't, he don't care. Feet tied up to no apron strings for the rest of his life. Does Husky uh -huh. know you're here? No, he don't. Where is he? He's in the brig. That's where he is. He's oh, in the he's brig where he belongs. You come sneaking around behind his back, bucking in and trying to run his affairs. Well, whoever you are, you just wait a few years about this. So being in the head. brig and yeah, being a brigand are the are different things. Yes. Well, Although, yeah. so being a, a brigand might, might land you in the brig. Oh. Yeah, that makes sense. Although, 
Well, I the brig to usually refers to a military fall. prison. Yeah. The brigands usually wouldn't be in so the military, but maybe, I don't know. Yeah, you never know. Eh, what a maybe pussy. The, <laughs> maybe they have syphilis. Oh, maybe he did, yeah. Nice little girl. Or maybe the blonde had syphilis strength. That's yeah, like old man strength? Yeah, yeah, she has syphilitic strength. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's Husky. Husky or Pete. I'm writing hey, that into my next campaign. No, Beautiful. I lost the address. I, I had to come myself. Yeah, that's a ticket. Hey, how did you get out? Well, they, Magic. They, speak, they finally found out it was you that done it. Huh? Yeah. Oh, well, I told them. I tried to tell them. I wanted <laughs> they to found out blame. because I told them. I guess them. <laughs> they finally decided to believe me. Huh? Uh, They're so well, clever. <laughs> but they blamed Hardy. Now he's in the brig. Oh. Tom Hardy? <laughs> finally. <laughs> finally. God. Oh, 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 the, uh, <laughs> oh, 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 Did you oh, say oh, you oh. saw Merlin? Jabba no Wonderful. Oh, sure. I just thought what a great guy you was. Oh, that's swell, Pete. Say. Ain't she a wonderful girl? Uh, yeah, she's got a nice set of uh, come on. Uh, you gotta eyes. Come back up with me. Uh, no. <laughs> I know. I gotta date them all. That ain't important, Pete. Come on. I want you and Myrtle to know each other better. I want to tell you some of the nice things you've done. Yeah, Myrtle for Beach. Me. Yes. They can. Come on. Oh, he's yeah. gonna marry Myrtle <laughs> Beach. <laughs> <laughs> can you do that? <laughs> Uh, I don't know. They're not very progressive in uh, South Carolina. Well, I don't know. I think these days you can kind of do anything you want. Yeah, I guess if you find the right minister. Yeah. That was a u universalist. What are they called? I don't know. Yeah, one of those. What do you mean, me? Yes, he's dead. Oh, keep quiet! Come on, yeah. Husky, get him in there. Come on, Husky. Come on. One of you can resurrect, we got right? Get some more water. Do you have a diamond worth 5,000 gold? <laughs> they have to res him. <laughs> it's Myrtle. She Gosh, killed him with a, so with a vase. It must have knocked yeah. me out. Yeah, yeah that's it. Right. Sure. Fine. He's up to his eyeballs in syphilis. I thought you was in the brig. Well, I was, but on account of Pete, I got out. Yeah, he, he agreed to uh, oh, he take something from the Admiral. Mm. Isn't that just in exchange for my freedom. I was mm. trying to find out what I should give him mm. for a wedding present. Yes, he uh, tried so hard he almost gave him The rear away. admiral. Oh, speaking of presents, here's a box of candy for you, Myrtle. Oh, I think that's about the dirtiest the naval Chinese title there is. Oh, thanks a million. Rear admiral? Cute. Yeah, it's pretty bad. Candy? Listen, say something. Unless you can think of a better one. Grease job. Oh, he just said hello. Yeah, speaking of greasing up. I love you. Oh. Long time. I told him that myself. He fell in love with Husky. That's all the girls. Oh no, he don't. There's only one girl in the world for us. Uh huh. Who? For us? Hold on. Well, so olive oil. Uh, gotta That's gonna be, gonna be a, a, a very interesting oh, marriage. Oh no, we're all gonna have a celebration. You know, we've been just dying for some excitement since we came back off that long cruise. No, uh -huh. no, Husky. Cruise? I can't. Oh. Do come a long cruise. Is that sure. what they call it? And this time, let's do something different. Let's have a three-way. Wait, the parrot, a four-way. Well, start your explaining, mister. You see the rear projection behind I guess him. I owe you an obviously not really on the water. Like I, do, mm -hmm. but I got Husky's interest at heart. Oh, yeah? Uh -huh. Your eyes, your hair, your... Yeah, I'm thinking about running the idea right next year. Yeah. <laughs> What's that got to do with Husky and me getting married? Everything. You ain't no fireside type. <laughs> you can get plenty no, of guys. No, she you doesn't do him. fireside chats. Anyway, a guy like me is more your type. Uh huh. Oh, so that's the way the wind blows. Just. Uh, the yeah. Speaking of blowing, uh, I got something uh, for you to sucks. do. You know what I mean. I'll, I'll drink to I that. Do. Gee, it's a beautiful day, ain't it? Gee, your hair smells terrific. Oh, so-so. But then I guess you sailors is used to beautiful days. In the tropics with native girls and everything. Oh, sure. The only thing I know. Yeah, we spent a lot of our time in Alaska. Malaria. Was yeah. she nice? Looking at each other in our briefs. Malaria ain't a girl, it's a sickness. Oh, excuse <laughs> me. I ain't very he, good He at dated geography. malaria for three years. Yeah. <laughs> so did I. 
So did you? Wow. I guess you're pretty anxious was, to settle down with Husky and cook the and books. sew and have six uh -huh. or seven babies. Yeah. Hey, hold on. You're living my life for me pretty quick, aren't you, mister? I wish I mean, we're going to give two of those babies of away. Why? Oh, uh, nothing. Never mind. I'm stupid. Didn't you ever think about getting married? No, I, I just think about the Champions League. Yes. And on, being Sarah, Sailor Jerry. Be alone in the afternoon. Well, for goodness sake, why? He's thinking uh, about founding his own distillery. Mm -hmm. I got a date with Husky. Oh, you'll be married to Husky What's she for a at? long time. One day off won't hurt. Her phone. She's looking at her, her phone. phone. <laughs> <laughs> she's on her phone. <laughs> well, something about she's, Husky. She's checking her messages. Don't tell me there's insanity in his family. I'll talk to you about it tomorrow, one o'clock. Oh, yeah, morning, it's full of it. Suppose Myrtle missed me while I was gone. No. Nah. Sure. <laughs> Gosh. She was she was banging every swabby girl. from here to Manila. Ain't she? Sure. What does she want with a fellow like me? Cephalus. Got Canadian insurance. Cephalus. Cephalus. She wants your cephalus. Uh huh. <laughs> well, this is exciting. Crash. Yeah. Please oh, boy, crash or something. I bet Pete's got it all fixed for me now. Yes. Pistol Pete? Pistol Pete, yeah. <laughs> Maravich, right? Yep. So, uh, this guy playing Husky, the actor is Ray Mayer. He actually died ten years after this was, uh, released. Aww. So he was 47 when he died. Um, he died in Salt Lake City, Utah. Okay. So, what was he in? Other than this garbage. He was in... Seven Keys to Bald Pate. Um, I Married a Doctor. Another Face. And Make Way for Tomorrow. Hold on, we're bearing the lead here. He's blowing up his chest. Right, like a puff, like one of those birds, right? Like, Don't they do that? Oh, yeah, yeah. When they're trying to, like, fight another male bird, they, they puff, puff out. Yeah. I remember earlier when he had the water wings? That's what that was. Right, yeah, yeah. No, I was thinking he was more like a teacher in California. No, he, like, blows into Myrtle. it. There's, like, a little tube, and he... <laughs> Blam! Who got shot? Uh, his... Uh, his tick got busted. Just off-screen, someone got shot? Well, she hugged him so hard that... Oh, uh, okay. I don't know. Sure. So this guy, let's see, he was in... Swing It Sailor was his first movie. Really? Yeah. Then he was in Prison Nurse, Merrily We Live, mm -hmm. All right. Garden of the Moon, cold. Comet Over Broadway, right, right. The Wrong Way Out, mm. and then a bunch of other bullshit. Oh, what a run. I haven't heard of any of these movies. <laughs> what a run. Snafu. All right. All right. So that's Husky, and then the other guy... That light is Pete, played by just, Wallace Ford. Can't she just take her? Can't she just take her eye thing off? No, let's staple to her face. Like that. Do that. It's that easy. No. Wallace Ford is known for Freaks. Oh, he was in the the movie Freaks. Um, have you seen that? No. Do better if you take off that thing. I've seen Freaks and Geeks. <laughs> well, no, it's not quite the same. Um, yeah. So Freaks was a movie that had a bunch of circus uh, people in it. It would, yeah. And it was uh, kind of in poor taste. We'll just put that on. Oh. Hi, Bill. Oh. Hi, Bill. Hi, Henry. No, my car warranty isn't expired, God damn it. Yeah, me. right. All right, he was also that. in Harvey, which is the one where the guy was seeing the invisible rabbit. Sure. If a Patch of Blue, which I've never heard of, and Shadow of a Doubt, which I've never heard of. Mm -hmm. He was on the Andy Griffith Show. Oh, really? Yep. He was on Lassie. He was on Lassie? He was, yeah, he was on Lassie. He played Lassie. Oh. oh. Hello. Wait, no, he was Lassie? <laughs> yes. <laughs> what are you doing with a parrot? He transformed into a dog. I hope it won't hurt Let's see. He was on The Travels of Jamie what? McFeeters. Right. Yeah, magical a world of Disney. Uh, uh, sure. Did you tell her that it was the parrot? Very magical. She says that's too good The Dick an Powell Theater. Oh. Mm -hmm. So I thought I'd take him over to the pet store and see if I could exchange him for a little dog. I always wanted a little dog. Well, why not? Tess of the Storm Let's Country. Let's see what they got. 
Uh, Tales of Wells Fargo. Oh, a movie called Warlock. Now, that sounds interesting. What is this you wanted to tell me about Husky? Well, you Twilight see, for the Gods. Husky's got a very flighty nature. Sounds Roman. So. Yeah. Playhouse 90. Oh, the Schlitz Playhouse. That sounds right up your alley. Oh, I'm in. So does the stories that marry me. There's a movie called Climax with an exclamation point. Then again, okay. in front of Ostock, when he fell That's after hours. Yeah, the sheriff of Cochise. That was uh, a um, audio slave song, right? Well, I'm glad to hear that about. Um, let's see. Like Screen directors' playhouse. Well, Jane you, Wyman presents the Fireside Theater. Jesus, guys, a lot of shit. I doubt that. Where is Swing at Sailor? It's way down the list here. Let's see. I'm serious. She couldn't say no. That sounds good. Syphilis is also involved. Yeah, yeah. I'm scrolling. This guy was in a lot of stuff. But these are all bit parts. Like he's not yep. like the Man, star. He's just you, I said to myself, yeah. the mummy's hand. That sounds good. The girl I've been dreaming about. Swellhead. Hey, you shut up. The nut farm. Here's where you get off. The mysterious Mr. Wong. Jesus, this guy's a lot of stuff. Good morning, good morning. How are you, Polly? Come on, come on, say hello. Oh, look. <laughs> look just like Boston's May Hardy. <laughs> Sure, Tom Hardy. What? what was that look? <laughs> she touched me. She touched me in my special place. All right, Swing It Sailor was like, he'd already done like 15 movies at this point, or more, so, okay. Look, there are the puppies. Oh, are they darling? It's all Spuds McKenzie. No, puppies aren't darlings, they're puppies. That's true. All right, so the director of this thing. Do you take trades? Raymond Cannon was born in 1892. Holy shit. I don't know. I never do this kind of business. Oh, but he's a very wonderful character. He never stops talking. He died in 1977. Go ahead, Gabby, say something. We talked so much, I named him Gabby. Although, his last movie that he directed was in 1945, so I don't know what he was doing after that. Living off royalties? Eddie, I think you make a uh, big mistake. You should call him. Not Please. back then. They, there wasn't oh, such a thing. I'm mad about Dory. Unless you were like a very, very top uh, dude. What was that? Sounds like a top director or actor. Let's see. So, is this his directing? No, this is writer. Well. Oh, no. Oh, he was the writer of the original Fast and the Furious. Okay. Interesting. See Swing It Sailor on here. Oh, well. Oh, uh, shit. The monkeys are loose. Now we're into, like, outbreak territory. Yep, here comes the syphilis. Oh, Swing It Sailor was one of the last movies this guy directed. Mm. Probably because of this scene right here. <laughs> yeah. Where are the red pandas at? What in the Sam Hill? For, re for reference, this is what happens every time I go to PetSmart. <laughs> yeah, that's understandable. And that's you right there, right? On the chandelier? Yeah. You gotta stay safe. You gotta stay out of the way. That's right. Who? Gabby, you know my little parrot. Oh, oh, am I supposed to know that? I'm a random person. <laughs> like, how would I know that? Nothing the matter with the parrot. He just talks too much. He can't sue him. He's got, what's that called? Qualified immunity. I explain everything. You see, I came in here to see if I could trade this parrot for this little dog. Look at him. Isn't he cute? And he pedals on him. I want the whole bunch of you. Sure. For Take what? That's not Take even a fair dog. trade. Take this story if you what? want. Why not? Please go a out parrot for a I puppy? Well, this is back in the 30s. What do you really mean? See, with my heart even then. Soul, please go. Oh, gee, thanks. What do you That's mean? That's what you're about. Do it for you sometimes. <laughs> Katie, bring Gabby. Huh? Oh. No, let's... All right, so... I'm that's... walking out with this puppy anyway. And All the right. parrot. Say, where is this man gone? Yeah, she, she made out like a bandit. She got home. <laughs> Any of the pets that don't sell become meatballs. Hey! All right, that was exciting. I've got to teach that bird to keep still. <laughs> yeah, goodbye. Gee, we had fun. Yeah, we sure did. 
I love my little dog. Is that all More than I love you. Ha ha. I love him so much that I'm thinking about naming him P.T. Jr. Well, how oh. about uh, you taking Junior and Sailor Junior Jerry. for a walk tomorrow? How about Sailor Jerry, yeah. Well, maybe. Why don't you drop around and see? Okay. Well. Well, I've got a boner, so I better leave now. Minute. Bye. Don't you think that P.T. Sr. should have a little good night kiss? Now, why didn't I think of that? Go ahead, Junior. Kiss your papa good night. Ah. <laughs> L O L. L O L surprise. You got a date again yeah. tonight, haven't you, Pete? Yep. Yeah. Hey, I love the nightlife. I love to boogie. Uh, Day tonight at a hotel room down the street. <laughs> yep, totally didn't spend it with your wife. I mean fiance, I, I mean I can't understand it. What? Me needing ten bucks? No, no, I can't understand yes. Myrtle. Every time no, I, 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 I completely her, understand you needing ten dollars. Oh, uh, absolutely. Forget it. Hey, those syphilis shots aren't free. He's probably running around with some heel. I'd like to lay my hands on him. I well, you are. I mean, so, yeah, you yeah, should. Yeah, you ought to be glad you're rid of her. But I don't yeah. want to be rid of her. I love her. That's only in the mind. Oh, no. You've seen anyway, her twice in this movie. More yes, he's love. in love with her, though. What's more important than love? The Navy. Oh. <laughs> the Navy's <laughs> okay. all right. But yep. You can't kiss a battle. I mean, if you're fighting a battle, I Maybe agree with you. Sure, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But the like, God, country, and around. everything, yes. Yeah, but I'm but generally speaking, yeah, love is more important than the Navy. There's nothing to stop you from re-enlisting. What for? What for? Because you That's get the, the company of people like me. An yeah. Yeah. Supposing John you get to Paul hang out with me in, in close Supposing quarters. Supposing Dewey said, what for? Yeah, and Dewey, I forgot about him. Admiral Dewey. Dewey cheat him and how? Don't you want to be ashamed of yourself? Hey. What? I am I ashamed. I thought we was going to be a great team. Well, we were. You were handling yeah. the motors and me the stick. I mm -hmm. uh, forgot well. about that. <laughs> mm -hmm. He's going to handle Husky's well, stick. I, I hadn't yep. quite thought about Shit. it like that. Well, you better start thinking about it. But you yeah, know, Nate. The fellow's got a right to get married. No, he ain't. Not until he's earned some kind of success. What are you going to do when you get out of the Navy? Oh, I suppose get some high-class job like driving a truck or something. Sure. But I don't know any That's millionaire class. sailors. You don't know any sailors on the relief either. Oh, I don't know. Maybe yeah, you're right. I think right. on the relief means like over. welfare, I think. I know one thing. What? Or like a pension. I'll bet you Admiral Dewey never met a girl mm, like Myrtle. I don't think so, because on the relief sounds like welfare to me. Like he's trying to say, oh, well, well, doesn't matter, hey, but <laughs> we're, we're barely paying attention to the dialogue as it is. No, none of this matters. No. Oh, I got a little work to do there yet. Oh, a little homework, eh? Hey, what do yeah. you mean? You know, I'm yeah, only got some syphilis to get. Oh. That's right. Yeah, sure. I might get myself a hint of gonorrhea as well. Just a hint, just a sprinkle. We'll be here any minute, okay. now, Junior. Aren't you excited? A light touch of gonorrhea. <laughs> What was I doing? Oh, dear. So I think uh, the scene coming up here is also from the, the trailer. I should point out to the audience, um, there's no trailer for this movie that I could find, so I made a trailer for it. So if the trailer that you saw, either on last week's episode or, or, or when I was advertising this episode, um, I actually made this trailer. So be impressed with my awesome technical skills. <laughs> Oh, glory to Satan. Yes. I think it's a shame the way you're Oh, glory to Beelzebub. Husky. Oh, you'll get over it. What do you want What does a she start you? banging Husky? Well, what, I mean... You know, Pete don't. Has he said anything? He, he doesn't care. Mm, not yet, but he will. She's got a disinfected couch. I don't think Pete's the marrying kind. Oh, you don't. Well, now I'll tell you what you He's do. the banging kind, though. When he though. comes, you go out for a walk. And right. then in a little while you come back, but Could be. don't ring. Use your key. I guess we and don't I'll know, but we'll phone. assume that. Yeah, we, we've seen no evidence of note. N nor will we. <laughs> oh, what? yeah. It's not Goodness. that kind of movie. No. What are you going to do to him? You'll find out. I'm going to keel haul him. I'm going to tar and feather him. Tar and feather <laughs> drawn and quartered. <laughs> Ooh. I got an idea. Mm-hmm. Why is she so desperate to marry one of these Navy guys? Yeah. I mean, they don't... Like, what he was saying earlier, they don't really have... Well, unless they're going to get a promotion, they aren't making shit in the Navy. No. 
Bring him in. Bring him in in chains. Hi, you folks. Hi. I think that's a person doing that voice. No. Well, what's it going to be tonight, little princess? The Waldorf, the Ritz, the penthouse? Well, you think that's legit? Or the... <laughs> and, uh, what they say, they train the birds to say, say all that. Right? I mean, right. it only takes, what, like 35 minutes to stand in front of the oh, bird and... Hello, Henry, hello, Henry, hello, Henry. Hello, Henry. Huh? Yeah, and then hope that he <laughs> says it on cue. <laughs> Eventually. I'll get it myself. Get going, mm. get going. Do you want me to go now? <laughs> yes, get lost. <laughs> oh, I miss it. You may have No, I changed my mind. You marry him. <laughs> yeah, I never mind. Come back in a little while. Let's swap out. Tag team. Tag Marriage. team, there you go. Why not? Let's see, what around here can I fence? Yeah. That's pocketing shit. Do, 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 do. Sits on a whoopee cushion. <laughs> Wonder if they got HBO here. Wonder if they get Skinamax. Oh, goodbye. So long. Oh, so long. yeah. Bye. Uh, so long, sucker. The hell is that? Ah. Uh. Nine, you gift wrapped a beer for me? What the fuck? <laughs> Did he pull the uh, top off with his eyes. teeth? No. Yeah. Beautiful. That's a sailor move right there. Oh, yeah. yeah. Guess maybe it does. Shit. He's checking out the caboose there. Yeah. Check that shit out. Uh oh. I'm dimming the lights. Woo! Uh huh. Gotta take his Viagra here. Yeah. Little blue pill. Do you mind if I put on some ministry? Yeah, is that better? <laughs> Much better. I thought I, I thought I'd throw that in there for you, Nate. Thank you. No. Thanks. Tell me all about the Navy. You well, know, it kind of sucks. Uh, you've got a beautiful night. There's a lot of ships involved and a lot of sailors, a lot of seamen. Yeah, a lot of us can't swim either. Right. Look at this guy. He's well, just. My ship's Go for it. Wow. The, the boilers uh -huh. are made of rubber and she burns ice. She's round What's the this girl's name? Okay, there's a lot going on here she right draws now. No water yeah. she don't know how. This is pretty racy the for 1938. Yeah. He's like grabbing a. Oh, oh, I thought he was going to go for. <laughs> tee -hee, tee -hee. Oh no. Oh my god, he unzipped. Was that a twist? <laughs> the twist top? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, they went into the condom jar. Yeah, right. <laughs> Next to the Worthers. Yes. Don't grab the wrong thing. Yeah, that could be disastrous. That was quick. Yeah, all done. Look. Isn't that time. A beautiful engagement ring. Yeah. Yeah, wonderful. That's just like the ring Husky's going to give me. Hey, don't you know uh -huh. Husky give you no ring? Yeah, good for him. Do you yeah. mean you want to give me one? Oh, oh darling, well, this is so uh, cool. uh, well, not quite. Well, you want two rings? Oh, yeah, one for each hand. Uh, no, we're not. Well, <laughs> do I have a say in this? Tomorrow's no. Visitor's Day, and I want everything to be ship shape. Are there gonna be a good many people on board? Oh, the vis visitors. Wasn't that, um, uh, Hardy, wasn't that like the, the miniseries V? What they called the visitors? All right, you guys. Uh, you lost me. Get busy like now. The reptilian aliens that came down. Turn two. Sure. Is this history channel? There was a series Get called V. Okay. I anyway, whatever. Spoil your I don't watch TV. But the People know what I'm talking about. You. They probably do. I only watch, like, Italian soccer. Lovely fella. Way less aliens than that. How is the well, homework? You look kind of down, Pete. I mean... Ain't the plot working? Not so good. I guess I turned on a little too much personality. Now there's I've got these the things in my called head. referees. What do you mean? Oh, I pay her a few compliments. Are they aliens? To get her away from Possibly. I... 
Now a, I got a few on of my them neck. Might what be. are you kicking about? If she feels that way about you, she's forgot Husky and he's safe. Sure, that's right. Yeah, but how about me? All you gotta do is keep away from her. Ain't you heard we're shoving off? Who's that guy? Tomorrow for target practice. On the level? Sure. What a break. No, the new I guy. Hope it's Not Husky. America. Or uh, uh, Killer Jerry. No, he's one of those hey, two uh, gay guys Husky, that were hassling them earlier. So well. But, uh, Remember when they were in the bunks? There was those yeah, two gay guys that were luring at the so very beginning. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Good. You know, I haven't been off the ship since. How now. much money you got? Twenty bucks. Two dollars. What do we do? I don't. Where does he keep what getting money do, from? Remember, he keeps giving it away, and no then he has more money. Women. Well, they get paid. No. Well, I know, but this Sailor Jerry's always I broke. I about this. Well, maybe well, he keeps spending it on syphilis. Oh, oh, oh. oh. Yeah. Syphilis treatments or like getting more syphilis? More. It's a, it's oh. a commodity, you, commodity you can buy. Oh, he's collecting it. Yeah. He's a hoarder. He's a syphilis hoarder. Yes. I'll give him a peek of my mind. Perfect alibi. What's the idea of keeping me waiting around here an hour and a half? Who do you think you are anyway? Is your car insurance expired? <laughs> car, car, car warranty? Whatever. I thought it yeah. was my Aunt Minnie. <laughs> Is your refrigerator running? Yeah, sure. <laughs> well, sure, I'm glad to hear from you. Y yeah, I know, but, but I got an aunt from Chicago, and I had to go out with her. Uh-huh. And I have a headache, too. Well, well, I was going to go out with her, but I might. I'm scheduled to have a headache tonight. All right. I'll be ready in 20 minutes. <laughs> and next Wednesday. Okay, I'll see you then. Mm. Goodbye. Release the Kraken. I'll show that fresh sailor. Ooh, fresh. Fresh! Stock footage on parade. So, good news, Nate. We have about 15 minutes left. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> That's all. All out. And dismissed, and they all run overboard. Ah, we sure had a swell time last night, didn't we? Sure. I guess we better stay what away the from what's up in McGinnis's pool room. Being in the Navy ain't so bad. Well, they got the ship beat out. Why don't the they pilot. have that scene in this? People. Think of the the that would have been more interesting. You and me. Yeah, absolutely. Well, it's up to us to keep peace all over the world. And while we're doing it, we're guests of Uncle Sam on the greatest sightseeing tour on Earth. So and I'm guessing based paid. on the fact that they have bandages yes, on them, maybe they got like we'll knife cuts all over the world, even if we have to or, kill or broken glass cuts maybe on their face. Maybe. We have to imagine what the scene was because they aren't going to show it to us. I might as well sign up for another four years. Face syphilis? I'm going to sign up for more syphilis. Yeah, there's a waiting list. I want extra syphilis. <laughs> so I'm guessing these are like normal citizens that get to come look at the ship? Okay. Groovy. Hey, look, Pete. You see what I see? Oh yeah, raising awareness for the non-war effort. Hey, look yes. this way, and maybe they won't see us. Then we can duck. But I want to see Myrtle. Why what? are they avoiding the I girls? I thought you just said you were through with women. Where's your character? I know they've What's been Myrtle? stuck maybe on a fucking aboard. ship for however long with a bunch of dudes. You have anything more to do with Iron? Maybe they prefer the company of men. They are sailors. Well, That's true. You and seamen. Mm -hmm. Small mm -hmm. world. You are what you eat. Uh, right. <laughs> Gosh, well, well, pretty. Uh, well. Speaking of swelling. Oh boy, what a big ship! Yeah, it'll take a long yeah, it's time true. It is a battleship. It's big. Started looking right now. Fun fact: This is how that TV series Wife Swap started. Oh really? Uh, yeah. They don't allow dogs aboard. Goes back to this moment right here. They'll put her off the ship. And put Come on, girl. No, Let's don't. What are you? What? Lieutenant. <laughs> Ten Hut. Adams, Martin Stone. The captain has quite a large part of your friends coming on board. A you part see a of your friends. Special guides mm. Like, are they in a <laughs> cauldron? No, I heard large <laughs> potty. <laughs> a large potty? Yeah. What was that? Nah, it was my emphysema. <laughs> <laughs> that was that same noise again. What was it? Uh, you're imagining things, sir. It's the syphilis. He's causing you to hallucinate. Uh, I want to go full. I want to go full Metal Jacket right now, but I I can't remember any specific quotes. Hey, listen, Why does he have the dog? Amuse yourself for a few minutes while I He stole it from the. 
her. Oh. Why? All right. Nobody knows. <laughs> If you know, comment down it, below it, and like yeah. and subscribe. <laughs> if anyone's following this plot, please comment. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I could look up the plot, but it doesn't really say much on Wikipedia. Nah, yeah. oh, it's not probably not worth it. The Wikipedia entry for this movie is very short. <laughs> Rightfully so. I didn't start it. Husky did. So what? I didn't start the fire. It's been burning since the fire. world's been turning. About, oh, fuck off. <laughs> about Husky being sick. He has fits. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah. Gets attacks. Seizures. Goes nuts. Little Billy Joel no for you. No one knows anything about it but me. What are you trying to do? Kid me? Oh, honest. Didn't no, you kidnap like you. Made that crack about there being Very similar. His family? What's this got to do with you breaking our day? That's what I'm trying to tell you. Well, I knew he was. I thought they were getting married. Now they're just dating. Well, had to get him off the ship. I could give him a medical discharge if they knew it. Go on. You want to date a dog napper? Oh, yeah. Him his pool room. He's, oh, trying him him He's trying to give him a discharge. He's trying to give him a discharge. <laughs> that might have something to do with the syphilis. I think he's trying to give her a discharge too. I think that's more of gonorrhea though. What? I think you're the biggest liar in the navy. Wow, that's quite a quite a title. I don't know if I've earned it. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Well, uh, look at Thank that you. Thing. Thanks. Now he has to wear a big sash that says "Biggest Liar in the Navy." And it's true. It's like the Miss America sash that you wear. Yeah, but he got promoted. Yeah. That you it's wear, terrible. Nate. I just, hey. Don't disclose my personal right, information. <laughs> I'm warning you. About what? Don't ever say anything to Husky. I'm warning you, Alice. Adam. To the moon, Alice. To the moon. You and me. All visitors are requested to leave. You and me. Yes, that means all visitors. And baby makes three. All visitors are requested to leave. Go on. Go long until ship. tomorrow night. Uh huh. It'd be hilarious if she was knocked up. I don't think they would ever have that in a movie like this, though. Nah. Because that would imply, you know, them sleeping in the same bed. Yes. Yeah. Well, or it might not even be his. I mean, they've already kind of mentioned she's kind of a slut, so. Also, he probably sleeps in a hammock, right? Yeah, that'd be. Well, he could be. They could be doing it at her place. Yeah, not, yeah, not wrong. Is she? Are they at a funeral? What's the? What's with the veil? <laughs> this is a lively funeral. <laughs> who, who died? <laughs> the audience. Yeah. The, well. Yeah. <laughs> Part of me died. Yes. Something inside you died, and then I did, and I just can't take it. Woo. Not really. He eats it. Uh, it's not chocolate, oh. damn it. Maybe you don't remember me. I'm Myrtle. I don't remember you, know you no. You're supposed to be engaged to? Well. Who? Hey, what's the matter with you? What's the uh, matter with you? Hey! No, is that just too bad? I've got worried. something. It starts with an S. I got a lot of things on my mind. Ah, oh, come on, snap on it. Let's see. So now she lifts the veil. There's a new ministry album out, and I can't. Yes. I can't stop thinking about it until I get my hands on it. That's right. I don't think they were uh, selling a lot of ministry albums back in 1938. Well, I mean, ministry is timeless. Oh, that's Fresh true. Cluck dancing yeah. with a swell doll. A swell a doll. That ain't Pete's Is that like a sex husband. doll? Yeah. It is now. He's been giving her the rush act, so she'll lay off us. He's been giving it to her, don't yeah. Tell me. Believe that. Yeah, don't tell me. Is that Superman? That looks like the guy who plays Superman. Going? Don't say nothing about what I said. Shut up. George Reeves? Or, no, Steve Reeves. Wait a minute. No, George Reeves. Steve Re Christopher Reeve? I'm no, no, no. The so there's Superman. Before the accident? Know. Is George Reeves and then Hercules is Steve Reeves. Well, one of the Hercules actors. Nice guy, that Pete. And then, yes, later on, Christopher Reeve plays Superman, yes. Yeah. Pre accident. What do you mean? Yes. Yeah. I, I, I always like to clarify that. Sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And giving you the grand rush. I mean, it's helpful. You know. <laughs> I guess he told you that he loved you. Why not? Yeah, what an idiot. Hey, don't you know it's a gag? What's a gag? 
Why are you just trying you. to bust up you and Husky? Is that a Nautilus in your sure. pocket, or are you just happy to see me? Since you know that big lunk's been stooging for Pete for years, doing all stooging. of his work, fighting all of his fights, lending him all of his money. You uh -huh. don't say. Sure. Yeah. Starts making out with her. I just did say. You don't say. <gasps> that whore. I gotta polish off my crack in here. Let's see 1,000. You say he turns into T-1000? Looks like, uh, what's his, what was his name? Richard Patrick? Robert Patrick, yes. Robert Patrick. There you go. That, some action, finally. Why, you big dumb fuck. I never laid my eyes on that. Excuse me? Dumb what? Well, I thought he is. <laughs> well, he ain't. But I'll tell you who the guy is that's been two-timing you. It's your pal. That's who it is. Your pal, Your Pete. pal, Sailor Jerry. Oh, Myrtle, you're crazy. We're both crazy. And do you know why he done it? To keep you I'm crazy in love. for him for another four years. Look, sure, why not? Look, there he goes now, trying to sneak out on us. No, oh, there he goes, Sailor Jerry. Fight! Is it true that you're Fight! Oh, Fight! Minute, Fight! Come on! Oh, can't you see he's lying? Can't see you see him? We've been together every If uh, Sailor Jerry was into oh. Filipino martial arts, or FMA yeah. for short, oh, yeah. this is... Well, you're big ape, you can't! Wow. Uh, or Full Metal Alchemist. Oh. Mm-hmm. Same thing. Yep, yep. And they both wake up in the hospital, the end. Oh. That uh, that that distance that they had between them during that confrontation would yeah. be ideal in Sailor Jerry's um, benefit. I see. That's where you want to be. It's close quarters fighting. Ah. Yeah. All right. Call the stock footage squad. Yeah. Here we go. So pre World War II, they flew these biplanes, and they had these. So those are very small versions of the carriers that they would deploy in World War II. Mm -hmm. And yeah, they used biplanes. Right. But this is the very tail end of that era. They had jet um, aircraft in World War II. Yeah. Or certainly during World War II, right? Yeah, during, yeah. Absolutely, yeah. This, what did you say? This is 1938? Eight. Eight? Yeah. All right, yeah. That's around the time where, yeah, like the transition would have, I would say, yeah. started happening, you yeah. know, but still like biplanes were like, this is what we got, sorry. Yeah, so if you see the single wing aircraft, those are probably jets. I think they, yeah. they have both in the scene for some reason. You missed, dummy. Yep. Yep. Captain, they missed. Should we turn around? Hello? Aye, aye, sir. Uh, I fell overboard. Over. Calling flight commander number one. Calling flight commander number one. Order all planes. All right, head straight for the Bermuda Triangle. Soon, necessary repairs are made on target. Repair party proceeding. Sounds good. Over. And everyone bailed out. Where are they Husky. going? Husky. Oh, for the love of Mike, won't you please listen to me? Don't call me Husky, Husky goddammit. I'm big boned. <laughs> a mug. Perfect. Do it. Maybe they'll get bombed by one of those planes. I didn't know you'd take it like that, Husky. Have a heart, will you? Usually he takes it from behind. You two men handle a collision. Matt and Lower, as soon as I wrap on the hull. The rest of you men come. Uh huh. Well, he's gonna wrap for us. Oh, finally. Sweet. All right, pass up that torch. Dump bumps, but dump bumps. <laughs> That'd be great. I brought this giant piece of plywood. Come on down with that timber, you guys! The toilet's overflowing! Come on, hurry up. What on earth are they doing? It, how do you. What? Maybe the ship got hit with something. <laughs> Maybe? I don't know. They didn't show it, well, hey, so we don't know. Oh, Gilligan. We hits him in the head with an oar or whatever that was. Yeah. <laughs> Nate, this is the big finale. Hope you're ready. It better be. <laughs> I gotta polish off my uh, crack in here. 
Yeah, I got, uh... Step on the gas. Actually, you out. know what? I should probably refill my drink. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I wouldn't. We're almost done. <laughs> but feel free. I have the rest of the one. night in front of me. Oh, that's true. One. Yeah. Time oh, Wing Commander. Wasn't that a video game? Yes, it was. Oh. Apparently they're playing Wing Commander on this. This is one of those uh, top-down um, uh, flight... She took her top down? It's... Yeah, well, that was... You had to get a mod for that. Oh, oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. We. Yeah. We. We don't know what's happening or why, but, you know, hey. Too drunk to notice. No, I'm not drunk. I might be slightly buzzed, very slightly. Someone keeps setting off fireworks on that ship. We must have left Husky on the target. Turn back! We can't turn back. We'd be blown to bits. We don't have time for that bullshit. Oh, now he's gonna go save Husky. Oh, no! Oh, remember, Husky can't swim, so he's... I don't know. Sure. Are they bombing that ship that he's on? No, they're just bombing the ocean. Yeah, but why does he care about that? He must be on a ship that's getting bombed or something. If we'd only been paying more attention to the plot, Nate, we would know why. <laughs> <laughs> yes. I'm sure there's some reason, but... <laughs> this is this is very Nine Inch Nails silent, like, video backing track. Sure. Kaboom! Keep dropping bombs right next to the boat. So seven hours later, he gets to the boat. You're supposed to hit the boat. Or right. Is he the shore? Is he on shore? He's somewhere in the darkness. Hello, darkness, my old friend. The Triforce. The flying Triforce. Yes. Strike force. Well. Hold on. How are they standing? They were standing in the middle of the ocean, and now yeah. they're swimming. Maybe they're on a piece of, like, debris. Uh-huh. Where's all that wood coming from? Aren't those ships made of metal? The door from the Titanic that, uh... Oh, it's still there. <laughs> it was still there, huh? Even though he totally fucking could. Please go. You're disturbing all of us. You'll have mentally. to sign this now, Stone. Is that the chaplain? Right there. Yes, sir. Your syphilis waiver. This is your death release. What is it, sir? The sweet Art release of death. Oh. Not Articles oh, of Incorporation? God, gee, I didn't know that you felt for the 86th time. Will you please shut up? Yeah. Yeah. Something for you, Hucky. Ooh, a you brought your uh, lunch? What is this? Oh, it's the parrot of it. Yeah, it's a bird. L O L. And you can have the stupid bird sign Myrtle. Stone, I am Sorry, it wasn't a dog. It is oh, she's married, Mrs. Ann Myrtle Hinklemeyer. Remember, she was Hinkle talking to the Hinklemeyer guy at the beginning. So she married that Hinklemeyer guy. Oh shit! So both of them <laughs> fucked off. Yep. All right. <laughs> hey! You gotta leave him laughing, Nate. Yeah. Or something. Yeah. No, it, not a single thing happened during that movie. I, I can't... The merciful end. <sighs> wow. Alright, okay. here's our credits. We got all kinds of Wallace Four, Ray Mayer, Isabel Jewell, Mary Kenneth Jane, Harlan. Cully Richards, Seamus O'Shea. Doctor, right. Conan Cripps! Yes. Go to the infamous gang in L.A. Yes, the Cripps. Alright, so that was Swing It, comma, Sailor. What'd you think? I hated it. <laughs> you hated it, huh? Yeah, it sucked. Yeah, it was um, it was a little dull. So as I said, I did pick the movie based on the title, thinking that it would be um, kind of funny. Yeah. And while it was intended to be a comedy, I'm not sure that it was all that funny. I don't know. There were parts no. of it that were funny, but it's, that were yeah, right. Uh, there were more parts of it that were unintentionally funny, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. which I uh, I enjoy, but uh, no, not, I did not, not like not this so movie. Much. I did not like this movie. Which is why I think it's a perfect movie for this show. All right. Sounds good.
Okay, well, um, I want to thank Nate Patrick for joining me on this episode. Thank you for having me. Do want to remind everybody, um, after uh, this stupid part, uh, we will have a trailer for the next uh, content that we're going to show, which will be Shorts of Palooza 2. And uh, so Palooza? you'll see that uh, in the coming weeks. And make sure to hit the like button if you enjoy this content and subscribe for notifications on future content. Okay, Nate, uh, thanks for joining me on this episode of Two Drunk Guys Watch. And until next time, keep things interesting. Yeah, uh, you never know. Yeah, what a maybe buzzy. The, <laughs> maybe they have syphilis. Oh, maybe he did, Ooh, yeah. Nice little girl. Or maybe the blonde had syphilis strength. That's yeah, like old man strength? Yeah, yeah, she has syphilitic strength. <laughs> <laughs>